Okay. Let's see. I don't think I could turn the sound down. It sounds... I think this audio mix is okay, but I'll just have to ask somebody. Ask somebody. When they show up. I know for me... Actually, no. My volume was turned up. It's fine. So, we're playing Bloodstained Curse of the Moon. This was originally a stretch goal by Bloodstained Ritual of the Night on Kickstarter. And, uh, we're gonna, gonna give, it a, give it a go. And Bloodstained Ritual of the Night is coming out on the 18th, which is just next week, next Tuesday. And we'll probably go right into that. And that, between this, which is a full-fledged fucking game, apparently, between this and Ritual of the Night, we will have plenty of content before we can finally get back to Bloodborne. Everything is bloody. It's just, it's fine. Also, hey, Shrike. I've played this long enough to know that I want to play veteran, and by that I mean I walked around the first screen and made sure my buttons work. I didn't even read this. There was once a man who had been given the moon's curse by demons. <laughs> this is a very simple plot. That man was Zangetsu. Wrapped in crimson garb with eyes like fire, he relentlessly pursued the demons who cursed him. They probably shouldn't have cursed him. That was a bad move. As he journeyed from one pit of darkness to another, he would stop at nothing until he struck down every last demon in his path. Yep, not vampires. It's not Castlevania. One night, he sensed the looming presence of a great demon. And for future vo people watching this, because this is going up on YouTube, uh, the person who made this uh, was a either the lead producer or director or something of Castlevania. One night he sensed the looming presence of a great demon. He swore to eradicate all, eradicate all demons, no matter how much of a threat they posed. Bathed in moonlight, he cried out as he drew his sword, which consumed the darkness from within its wretched steel. On that night, either the demons or the moon itself would feel the wrath of his blade. Now, if he could cut the moon from Earth, that'd be a hell of a feat. He'd be very strong. Didn't say what the curse did. He, just that he was cursed. He de and we know he doesn't like it, so it's probably not a good thing. I mean, it's, it is a curse, not a blessing. Hey, look. There we are. Looking at the moon. There we go. Moonlight Temptation. So, this is very Castlevania. I cannot move or redirect myself while I'm in the air. I cannot slow down. I cannot turn. I get, I get my little tiny crouch. Get a jump. I don't have a whip. I have a little little blade. It's it looks kind of like a katana, but I'm not really sure. Uh, I have my other buttons don't do anything. I have my sub weapon, which is a like a diagonal whip. And this is all I know about the video game. And then, I mean, the art's wonderful, but uh, the classic oh, hit the fucking lamps and. You get sub-weapon points, which is in the top right under weapon. Let's see, we have lives in the top left, our portrait, our current sub-weapon, a health bar made of pips. Very retro. That's Castlevania's fuck. Right there. Ooh, look at that. Bloody. Oh god, how are stair stairs gonna work in this one, I wonder. Oh no. We do want to go up. Castlevania is always about finding the right path to take. Up. Up. Hurt. I don't know what the fuck that was. But we got it. It's ours now. Whoop. Oh no. Gotta go back up there again. I will say it's a little, I think it's a little faster to attack than, uh... Oh, we can't jump onto this, can we? No. Oh, we can! That's good! Original Castlevania, you could not. So that's a little quality of life thing. That's a bunch of, oh, that was a bunch of points. Or, uh, sub-weapon points. Wait, is there a chicken? No chicken in the wall. It's not Castlevania, guys. It's fine. Got a 
check. Gotta check for that chicken. Don't know what that purple thing was. Oh wait, different sub weapon. Ooh. That lasts for a while. Oof, that is hard to hit him, that's for sure. Heart. What if a heart's actually health? Ooh, there's a path here. I think the later Castlevania games on the NES start to take different pathways. So we can either go up or to the right. Ah, I suppose we'll just go to the right. Ah, uh, actually no. We're gonna go up because that's not... We can always come back down, is my my theory on that. Oh, that skeleton wants me to go that way. Aha! I don't know what was in there. Seems like I need sub weapons with the Y button, however, that would require weapon points. If I destroy lamps, perhaps I can find a magic potion to restore my weapon points. I also understand that different colored lamps contain various sub weapons I can use. Even so, I remain devoted to the sword. Fair. So there's. Oh, that's a big potion, big weapon. I see. So what's that door then, I wonder? If that's tutorial shit, then what's this? Oh, I can't go in it. Good. I am clipping through the ceiling there. That's... Odd. Very odd. Alright, lamps do not reappear if I see transition. Good to know. Does he shoot? Oh, he shoots when I jump. Okay. But I have to be in his path. Oh, I can hit the flame. I don't know. Okay, so that's what dropped before. Which is just a bunch of score, I suppose. Oh no, I'm on the train. Oh shit! Oh, they got me with that one. They super got me with that one. Hearts re regenerate health. If I keep walking, we won't hit me. Okay. But I have to keep walking. Uh, each little encounter is a little fucking puzzle. Oh no. It's like a, hey, I have to walk forward enough to trigger the enemy to walk toward me. And then walk backwards. And then kill it. And then trick the lamp. What's over here? Choo choo, motherfucker. Where are we going? Who knows? Who cares? This looks. Now, you could not do this on the NES, that's for goddamn sure. too far. Look at that damage. It's real good. Now, sub weapons have historically been kind of puzzle solvers. You can do everything without them, but typically, not always, but typically they give you what you need to deal with a certain situation. It might not be the best thing to use, but they the game is trying to help you. Usually. Might not be super clear that it's trying to help you. Like this. It's like, hey, maybe maybe you should use that really good sub weapon against the big boy over here. And then I can just do this. And make and trivialize him as an opponent. And he's telling me to go that way. What's this way? Oh I can't. I can't know. I can't tell. anything without backdrop. I think we're on the first boss in a second. Nope. But they're... That's a boss fountain, though. They're giving me big, big points here. They're getting me fucking ready. They're telling me the whip is good, so I'll trust them. What the 
fuck was that? Oh god. It's, oh, this is coal. Alright, how do you attack? I see. Oh, no health bar. Ah, uh, well, there, there goes that. Oh, Jesus, okay. I have to wait for him to... to do the hand. And then I can fight him. I see. I guess I- maybe I can stand on part of his hand, the far farthest left part. It's weird, one thing that's different, I don't see his health bar. It's very strange to me. Yes, I can stand on that, that's good. Poor strats. So we don't want to be anywhere near him. want to be like mid-ground so I can dodge these poorly. And then back over here. And that's pretty much the boss, I think. Hey, there we go. Oh no. Oh, oh, I missed. Oh, Jesus. He almost killed me with his dying breath. That's super close. <laughs> Damn. So cool. Is that a person? Oh, hey. Maybe I should talk to you. That, oh, that's hers, even though it's red. Thank you for saving me. Was it the demon's power you used to seal that beast? You. You're a shard binder. That power, that power can summon forth demons at will. I cannot allow that. Wait, it's true that I'm a shard binder. However, I've sworn to be ever righteous in my command of this power. I refuse to be used for evil, despite that happening to you just moments ago. Then show me the proof of that determination in battle. Oh, we get to choose her now. Neat. Hey, Jelsey, how you doing? Oh my god, that's what I- I can just swap! And she has a whip! That's just a fucking Castlevania whip! Holy shit! The fact that I can swap on command, that's super fucking cool. Yep, switch with them. No one is without strength, strengths and weaknesses. If I make good use of my allies, I can traverse seemingly impassable terrain. Whenever I reach a crossroads, I'll take the shortest path without fail. But come and to a fork in the path where I can't determine the shortcut, I'll follow the remains of fallen adventurers to lead me in the right direction. Each of my allies has their own stamina. If their health gets low, quickly switching places would be a wise idea. Each type of sub-weapon that appears when destroying lamps can only be used by a certain person, it seems. No one else can even pick them up. Interesting. Whip smash! High jump! Slide! Oh, she's quick. Oh, that's super sick. Yeah, he jumps a little shorter. So I guess we could probably go backwards. And do some other routes with her if we now have her in the past. Because video game logic, basically. Frigid hell. So, I have a knife. Now we have knives. So she's got good range. She attacks a little slower. But it also is a longer hit, like the hitbox stays active a little longer, which I think I might prefer. The slide is not faster than just walking now. Ah, eh, whatever, buddy. I'm going behind a door, you can't get me now. Ooh, multi hit. Now it's Castlevania. I mean, not Castlevania. Hmm. There we go. Can I 
jump? I cannot jump on him on this. Oh, is, is that movement random? Oh. I'm gonna stick with the, uh, hey, money. With the triple up shot. Seems neat. So the game wants me to go this way. So I, I guess I'll just go this way. Oh, he has more health. He has two more pips than her. Interesting. How did he get up here if she can jump fire? Who knows? Doesn't matter, it's fine. I saw that fucking eye, those eyes. Wait, how's it? Mm, it's fine. Now I wonder if it's instant death for falling. I bet it is. Old school. Oh, I can break any of them. Let's see. Oh, oh, damn it. These are some creepy fucking monsters. They don't really do anything. They're just kind of in the way. Now, one of the biggest mistakes you can do in a game like this is not use your sub weapons enough. They can save your life. Sure, you, I could have probably killed that floating guy with my, uh with my whip. Like, why risk it? If he hits me, I'll get knocked backwards and fall and die instantly, probably. It's not worth it. So let's open this door. Can I not go through this? Hmm. Alright. Man, I haven't played a good 2D game in a while. Like, just like a classic, a retro 2D game. I don't even think I played all the original Castlevanias. Well, that guy, fuck him. I'm not, I don't even want to know how he works. I'm just gonna hit him every time I see him. Fuck him. Fuck him. Oh no! I missed. And it is instant death. Big sad. Oh, and she's dead. I can't swap to her. Well, shit. Oh, he does, he does that, huh? Safer just to attack, I suppose. I wonder if I just can't get her back until the end of the... end of the, uh, mission. You're new. Jeez. Oh god, what am I doing? Oh, that's a dick move. Oh no! Oh, I have a total number of lives that encompasses everyone. Yeah, see, she's a little better for this particular section. Oh, and that is the way you solve that encounter, also. But even if I didn't have it. Oh. The whip is also just, like, really good against them. She is just really good against them. <laughs> Damn. I should avoid killing off my teammates. And I bet it's gonna give me, yep. So it looks like I get a sub-weapon depending on who I'm using at a given time. A chicken? No. Man, that's brutal. I think that's an extra life. Oops. No? What was that? There we go. Easy. Easy peasy. 
Big help. Hmm, I guess I'll take it. Oh my god, it's just big damage. I did not expect her to get the big fucking axe. I'm gonna keep that axe, that seems really neat. Wait, does she have a different... No, they ha we have the same weapon pool. Why are they giving me... How much damage does this axe do? I wish I, I, wish I could see their health bar. And he is a, like a centaur, but a turtle? Uh, oh, I did hit him. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Oh, she's going down pretty soon. Oh, I'm, in, I'm out of fucking money. Oh, he was just gonna... Right. Oh, no. <laughs> ah, right. He's just gonna... Almost getting her killed. I kinda need her. Trying to need her. He does attack faster. Yeah, I did it. I think. Oh, this might be his death throw. Jesus. How was I supposed to avoid that? I wonder if you could slide under it. Hey, only one full death so far? That's not too bad. Ooh, am I gonna get four or five teammates? That's pretty sick. Who the fuck are you? I don't be defeated by a demon. I've been thoroughly humiliated. I am Alfred, an alchemist. Alchemist, you use demons to fulfill your worldly desires. Every achievement requires a fair exchange. Even using demons is sometimes necessary. You have your own goals, correct? My power may may be of use to even you. Your existence is existence I can't talk, fucking talk. Your existence is unsettling to me, but your skills are not without value. I'll leave your head where it is for now. We get an ally. What the fuck's his deal? Hmm. I can switch, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Each of my allies has their own stamina, blah, blah. Just as a reminder, and Alfred. Buster Rod, X. Use Alchemy Y. Use his weapon points. Hmm. He doesn't seem very good. Like, offhand, seems kind of shit. But he must have something going on. The brilliant boy. Look at that. Oh, that's, that's pretty strong. Yeah, you know what? That's, that's a pretty strong just, I'm not gonna really fight anymore. I'm just gonna walk forward and, uh... Everything else can die. Seems to take a bunch of points. And what's this skill? Ooh, that's a good one. I'm always a fan of mirror imaging like this. Alright, he's got some cool shit. And this probably makes him immune to that as well. Look at that. 
Man, our protagonist isn't actually very good. Also, I just realized, look at our fucking health. From the main dude to the fucking alchemist. Oof. That's a not, that's not much health at all. What do you want? He's not pointing any direction. What do you want? Hmm. I like the axe she has. He is designed for this enemy, holy shit. Goddamn. Who is this? Holy shit, it's just summoning a giant arrow. His attacks are fucking slow though. Oh, it freezes them in place and instantly kills them, what? He is very- he's a glass fucking cannon. That's all he is. He's just a glass cannon. I could have probably jumped on top of him. Whoops. I don't suppose I can su no, he's dead forever. Now I do like her axe, but we have to be reasonable once in a while. No. Oops. I wonder how far down I can go before I die. I don't really want to find out. Oh, he's mid-attack. Alright, I had just started up my attack, I should say. Uh oh. She's jumping too... She's too good at jumping for that area. It's Alexandra. We're playing the classics. Maybe I could. I'm not. Hey, that's a fucking mimic. No, it's a bug inside a chest. Oh. There we go. I'm actually not sure on that timing at all. Oh wow, they are immune in there, huh? Oh, I just have to wait until they attack, that's all. Nothing fancy. And 40,000 points seems to be the, uh... The amount of points you need for an extra life. That's good to know. That's doable. I fucked that up, that's fine. Oh, and just an extra one-up. Don't mind if I do. Hmm. Points are actually very valuable. If we can just get extra lives. I mean, it takes about three levels to get one, but... Ooh. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. running for my life. And I don't have enough points to find out. Oh, I think I just get a huge buff. That's all this is. Ah, that rat doesn't care. Jump too high. Oh no. Oh no. No. Oh, she's dead. Shit. Those those spikes do damage. Alright, 
As long as I don't let everyone die, this is still doable. Still doable. Fucking rats everywhere, oh my god. Oh, and they won't stop, actually. Great. Are they worth points? Maybe. There might there could there could be a reason to farm them if they are worth something. Because every every forty thousand, if you really hated your life, you could just keep getting those points. Oh, you know what? That flashing icon we saw before, that might have been a, an ally resurrect. Now that I think about it. Hmm. Not sure what that's supposed to be. It seems like there's a bit of replay value, huh? Oh, I, I can't get it because I'm not the... because the lady's dead. Oh, no. Can't resurrect her, I guess. never know what the fuck that does. It seems like a life up. To be honest. Wow, I'm really surprised I didn't get hit there. Oh, that flashing item we found? I think was extra weapon points. Oh no, it's a money monster. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's a stand. That's pretty neat. <laughs> oh no, it's a catalyst. Capable of crushing me against a wall at the very least. Oh no, he's gonna punch me. Ooh, fancy. Oh god. Making me fight bosses? Rude. Or, uh, mini bosses while I'm fighting him. Oh no! I did not mean to do that. Whoops. I wanted to get to the top and then swap with the old man. No! Oh, that probably did some damage, I hope. I like that he had a custom frozen animation. Alright, I can... Oh, not do that. That's bad. There we go. That's how you deal with that shit. Oh no, I was too far away. If only the lady didn't get fucking shanked, it would have been fine. There we go. Uh -oh. Is that gonna hit me? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Not like this! Oh, no. They were skulls the whole time. That wasn't money at all. It was death. Hello, another fallen warrior. Who are you? You look like a protagonist. Cursed Shardbinder, you carry the power of numerous demons. Very perceptive of you. I require the demon's power to achieve my revenge. At this moment, our objectives align. Cooperation would be fruitful for us both. 
So be it. I'll let you continue breathing for now. Gavel has become an ally. Or Javel? Javel sounds less stupid. Uh, same thing. Am I a vampire? I, I'm kind of acting like a vampire. He doesn't have a ton of health. But he acts like a vampire. Summon darkness. Immortal metamorphosis. Siphon blood during metamorphosis. Interesting. Moving around. Press A during metamorphosis. Ha, huh, so I don't think he gets sub weapons. He's just a vampire. Oh, I can't go backwards, can I? Because I kind of wanted to, wanted to do that dungeon again so I could, you know, get that heart, whatever that heart did. Oh, he's weaker? I need to attack somebody without, with uh, someone else. No, they all take two hits, okay. His attack going vertical is actually pretty good. He just flings bats. He's a rude dude. That's got some nice defense to it. some knowledge for us. Alright, let's try this shit out. Hmm, that's fine. I can get into places I can't get into otherwise, so that's neat. Oh shit. This is actually super cool, the way you switch between people. Not chicken. Nothing. Oh, but what about here? Could be right here. You never know. It doesn't. <laughs> Hurt. Overall, we're getting a lot of health. Assuming we don't let somebody die. Because if we let someone die, then it resets. And if we're fighting like a boss, that's not a good plan. Oh god, he can't hit things on the ground. He actually cannot hit something that's on the ground. Rats is only weakness. Hey, Archer, buddy. I fucked up. Ooh, he can shoot down. What a jerk. How rude. Yeah, through the wall. I'm such a hero. Oh, if he's equipped, the uh, the, the sub-weapon thing doesn't give me anything. It gives me... Or it's not that it doesn't give me anything. It specifically gives me... Um... Just a big potion instead. Which is quite nice. Oh no. I was right about being able to stand on that. <laughs> so, I guess we don't have a reason to go back over there. There's not much benefit in searching every room for every object. If you have enough shit, then you're kind of good to go. The longer you exist, the more damage you're going to take, so it's better to move on quickly than try and hang out for any particular reason. Good job, skeletons. Do 
doing okay by me. Yeah, he's quite strong. I like him. And if I didn't have him, I guess I'd be taking longer routes. Although I don't know. I bet this door doesn't open. Yeah. Wonder what that means. Oh, I get the burning passion ability. I forgot. Oh, he can multi-hit somebody. If he hits with multiple bats. Neat. It's just hard because they evaporate so quickly. That was actually super lucky. I don't know why I swapped to him. <laughs> the alchemist is the worst in fighting. He's got that one good ability. And honestly, that's all he's got going for him. Hmm. You know what? I'll take that. And I want that. I want that to be bad. Because that, I believe, is what gives me extra... Yes, it does increase my weapon. That's super good. That means that fucking Shining Heart was going to increase our damage, and that's a shame. Or, our damage, our health pool. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Oh well. We'll survive without it. It's clearly optional, so... Give me those points. Oh no, right, it's on the ground. Oh god. Alchemist is almost dead. <laughs> Need to be really careful with him. Ah, Christ. Oh, they just won't stop now, okay. You know what, I bet that over there is health. This is hard to get to. No, it wasn't. Weird. They don't hand health out very often, it seems. Oh god, her attack is super slow. You know what? Fuck it. We'll go Axe. Why not? Ooh, do we have a dragon? What the fuck is this? Oh god, it's a multi-headed dragon! <laughs> Holy shit! How do we get up there? Nope. Not sure how to avoid that one. Different attack patterns, maybe? There we go. He got fucked. Oh. Be really careful with that. This can't be it. There's gotta be more to it. Okay, at least I'm sending the right. Oh, jeez. Oh, I wasted my attack. Christ, this thing is super pissed. Doesn't seem too tough. That first round was a lot, ooh, a lot tougher. Hey, not too bad, not too bad. Cool design. That's a cool looking enemy. 
Oh wait, I need to keep my hands on the controller. Maybe? No? That time it didn't self-destruct at me. How about that? Oh, you get a bunch of points for having weapon points left over. A bunch of score. Are we actually on the last level? No. There's probably like one more level after this, I would think. Considering this game was basically free. What the fuck? That's just like a... Like a jellyfish with a giant fucking mouth. That's creepy as shit. You know what? Her ability to jump seems very strong here. And her range. Her range is so good. Other than the... I, I would say the Alchemist is the one I'll probably use the least. Just because he's kind of fragile. I suppose if you do it right, then... He isn't that fragile. For a second, I thought I was going to clip myself. Clip my head on the top of the fucking... Uh, <laughs> stage and just plummet to my fucking death. But there's a pro strat to uh, killing him as he attacks. You know what? This is pretty good. Also, I have to know, why am I not going up here? Ow. Rude. Jesus, he did a... He's doing so much damage to me. That is an enemy solved. Is this a separate path? Yep, I wasted my time. I actually should listen to those skeletons. They do know best. Look at that. Fancy. So they're taunting me. Let's see if I can do this. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. I have just enough. So I guess there is sometimes a good reason to explore. But it's also dangerous, and if you fuck up, you're just dead. So, you know, I didn't mean to do that. That dude was not as strong as he looked. Secrets over here, either. I think we actually, unless I fuck up super hard, we might get through this tonight. Oh, fuck, it's high. Oh, I. Mm, well, you know what I was saying about fucking it up? That's what we're doing right now. There we go. That was actually super easy. I should not have to use the alchemist in an aggressive way. I need to use him for his fucking... his ice shard, and that's it. Wait, are we at the boss already? Damn. That was pretty quick. But yeah, that that's a... Well, first off, that's almost a Mega Man-esque door. But this does... Oh, it's a mini-boss. A proper mini-boss. You gonna stop me or what? Oh, 
Okay. Can I jump from here? Yes. He's not too bad. Look at that. Easy. Just need to make sure Dracula doesn't die. I mean, not Dracula. Jabed? I forgot his name already. Doesn't say- that should say his name in the top left, it doesn't. Look at me, I'm a bat. Oh, oh, if I get hit, I stop being a bat. Interesting. Oh, Christ. Fuck this. Oh. Oh, no. Stop it. <laughs> Oof, I need to be a little more careful. Oh, I should have checked the wall up there. Whoops. Oh, well. Okay, I'm not letting him die here, that's for sure. Oh, God, I don't want her to die here either. Oh, God, what am I doing? It's all falling apart. <laughs> Full health for all of oh only for him, but I think that increased health for everybody. Damn! If only I had got that first one. Damn! 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 Honestly, had I known, I would have. Uh... I probably would have just killed myself to redo that section to make sure that I had her available. That'd be the smarter move, huh? to use him for this. Kinda. Yes, he seems good. He seems pretty good there. Pretty good. Although, what would happen if she died here? Hmm. I don't think I was supposed to go down there. That seems like suicide. I mean, maybe that's a secret, but I don't trust it. That's for goddamn sure. I didn't want that. Oh well. You know what? Maybe I do want that. <laughs> Game's trying to help me. Game's trying to help me. I actually realize I don't really care too much what uh, the first two use. I really only care about what Alfred uses. And I really want him to have that ice spear. I also would like him to not be dead. But, you know, you can't have everything. Oh god. <laughs> it was not worth it. <laughs> I maxed out. Oh, that's for him! That's for Alfred and I'm dead! God damn it! Ah, that's a shame. That seemed like it was special. I mean, it was all glowy and shit. And I'll never know. I'll never know. Unless I somehow completely die with everyone here, and then I'll probably know, but... At least for now, we'll never know. Ooh. Am I gonna be pushed by the rain during a boss fight? That sounds frustrating. Yes. Here we go. Ow. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh, 
Oh, I can break these. At least for a second. Oh no, I can break them for longer than that. Oh no. Wow, she's a good... She's a good... She's important for this fight. Oh no, what am I doing? Fucking laughing at me, goddamn. Yeah, she's super good for this. I wonder how much health this boss actually has. It's hard to get consistent hits on him. Hey, yeah, he doesn't take many hits. That's much help. She does. Nope, can't hit him right now. Oh no, he's fucking up the boat. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Why do they all have to do that? Oh my god. Fucking suiciders, all of them. Hey, Alfred's back. Here's the castle. Part one. Tragedy of Slaughter. Alright, what do we got? You want me to use this? Oh, he bounces off the screen. It's a little confused as to what the hell it was doing. I think we're actually near the end. I mean, like, two levels. This one and then the final one. Maybe three. Because we're starting to see some re uh, some reused assets. Man, I don't like the way this is positioned at all. <laughs> I don't like that shit. He's just gonna try to knock me into the goddamn hole. I could do something different for her. Oh god, is that lava? I don't like that. I don't know what that did. There's just a lot of I don't know right now. And what's in this? I wonder. Oh, that's for him. Okay, good. I didn't completely miss it. I want to kind of want to know what it does. Oh. Oh, oh, it just keeps fucking things up. That's super good. Okay, Alfred, you're staying in the back line for a while. He needs to keep that. That seems like a boss killer. Or a big dude killer. You know, whichever. Nope, not that door. Hmm, I wonder if those doors only open if I'm missing someone that, I'd, that I would need for, like, a part like this. Oh, Jesus. They've increased... They've increased their axe throwing. Damn. They actually did a really good job with this game in that... Who I need to be to deal with certain situations. Like, they've really thought about how each person is just slightly different enough that you'll be like, yeah, you know what? I do want to switch and not just be the main character or the second character the entire time. Because it would be kind of foolish to not be swapping constantly. And they just... Turns out, yeah, that guy really did. What's his... Whatever the hell his name is. I should probably know this. Uh, yeah, he really did create Castlevania because he knows his goddamn shit. Uh, am I just gonna bulldoze through this? Hmm. Strange. That's odd. Well, I can't. It, I know you, what you want me to do, buddy, but I. I don't think I can do it. 
Jesus, that's too close. Hmm. No, I'm, I'm gonna take a longer route for that, because I don't understand what he wants. Don't feel like killing myself just to check something. Oh, really? Oh, I can hit those axes. I did not know that. Oh, they can hit me too. Oh god, they can hit me too. <laughs> hmm. Shit. Hit me forward. God damn. Still wants me to go that way, huh? Alright, well... She's super dead. Why don't we just rush past this part then? Oh god. Oh god, I can't even... That doesn't stop time like I thought it did. Oof. Oh yeah, I forgot. That ability's amazing. <laughs> Alright, well, we're down basically two people. I can't be Batman anymore. That was some bad damage, but the one-up does offset all that pain, so. Oh, I don't have it. I don't have it. Can I? No, I can't. Duel! Nothing. Oh, all right. So there was a way, there was a path. I just don't understand what that path was. And the upper path, honestly, I think it was better. Oh God, it's Scissor Man from Clock Tower. Holy shit. What's he doing here? Also, God damn, I wish I had the chick again. She's one of the few people I need all the time. So, I think the trick is, accidentally learn this, jump over him. <laughs> Come on, Scissor Man. Yeah, they give you a ton of time to jump. Ton of time to jump. See you later, fucker. I'm not fighting you if I don't have to. shaking oh god oh god <laughs> god damn it uh, I think I need to use him Ooh, I need to just be a little closer I think it's this fucking instant kill spots huh Well, here we go. Don't die on me, Alfred. You're all I got. You're all I got, Alfred. You know what? He needs a health more. <laughs> this is looking grim. Come on, boss fountain. In the wall. Nothing in the wall. Oh boy. Oh, it's not the boss yet. Weird. Is that just a bunny lady? That's just a bunny lady. She's gonna kick my ass. Oh god, she's actually kicking my ass. She just does a big d Oh! Oh, I need to jump out of the way. Okay. I thought that was just a special effect. No, she's killing me with what appears to be love. Okay. 
Wow, she takes the fucking beating. Oh, deal with that, fucker. That is a bad use of that attack. Why am I dueling her? Don't don't really know. Prove that I can. It's actually I I want to know what's in this lantern, and she didn't respond. Good. Ah, that was not health like I was hoping. Oh Christ! I could really use the lady right now. Her? I get some health. Gotta get the right cycle. I don't want whatever's in there. What I have now is the best chance I have. Okay. We're we're making progress as much as we can. You go, electric ball. You solve all my problems for me. Yeah, you do it. Fuck, it got me anyway. We killed each other. <laughs> Holy shit, when did we get up to 10 lives? We started the game with four. What the fuck? All right, that's fine. Yeah, touch me, come on. Come on, fuckers, touch me. Touch me! Good old Alfred. I'm gonna miss Electric Ball, but what's this one? Oh. Oh god, Alfred, don't die. I might need you in the future. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, secret! Double seek. Oh, damn. I was too eager. I wasted that healing completely. But for what it's worth, we're not going to use Alfred in a fight, in a boss fight, because he's not useless. This looks familiar. Fuck, I did it again. Just a hammer of returning, goddammit. This has very strong Castlevania vibes right here, in particular. Listen, fuckers, can you just stop it? This is just Medusa heads all over again. It's all it is, is just Medusa heads, and I hate Medusa heads. Everybody hates Medusa heads. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Apollo. Apollo? Look at that fucking not Dracula! Oh shit, this is a direct reference to a boss in the upcoming game. I think she might even be the boss. Alright, I can dig this. I like this. Uh-oh. Oh, they- oh, they don't hurt me, they just... That's good, that's good. Phase one done. She still has our umbrellas. Okay. Oh, she's mad. Oh! I did that right. Hey! That wasn't bad at all. After I died once. I'm back to ten lives. Nothing bad happened. Okay, now it's probably two levels. Probably two levels. We'll see. Frogs. Oh god, I wish Alfred had the other fucking spell right now. Can I just... can I... no? Can I do this? Yes, I can. There we go. <laughs> Problem solved. 
Ah, uh, there we go. You go, Alfred. You do it. Oh, Jesus. I thought for sure I missed. Oh, God, there's a lot. There are a lot of dudes wanting to kick my ass. And I don't appreciate all of them. I don't care about that. I thought that might have been like a good item, it is not. That seems good. Maybe it improves my defense, who knows? The game's not gonna tell me. Ah, neat. I'm so lazy that I switched characters instead of... Wait, his whip, upward whip thing actually does a lot of damage. It does two hits at least. But yeah, I was too lazy to actually get closer to that rat, so I just switched characters. Ah, yes. I have to be strong. Oh, they're being dicks about it. There we go. I thought he was gonna stop at some point, he did not. But I think all those points were worth it for Alfred. Oh, it's a Mega Man thing. All right, all right. I can dig it. That's actually way more warning than Mega Man ever gave us. That's fine. Who doesn't love those Mega Man block puzzles where you, if you fuck it up, you're goddamn dead? Aren't they the best? Alright, I could easily cheat past this. Instead, I'm going to risk her life. For almost no game. That was... That really wasn't any game. Does that come back? No. And if only these guys would work as a team at the same time, I feel like everything would go a lot easier. But they're very insistent that they'll only fight one at a time. Like most protagonists, where they have honor. And they just, I guess they don't feel like it. They could never team up, that'd be too easy. Hmm. I don't think this is gonna hurt them. Oh, you know what? I bet that up there gives me some ice. I'm just gonna check. Nope, that doesn't do shit. Oh god, it's there! Oh god! No! Damn it! Damn it. Everything's ruined now! <laughs> Whoops! I kinda fucked that up, huh? I'm very afraid of these goddamn machines. I feel like they're gonna change direction on me. I know that's not happening, but I'm still afraid of it. Hey, could you uh, fuck off? Whatever the hell you are. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I don't like this. It was going the other way. I thought it was going left. It was going right. I looked up because I was distracted. I think I can go this way now, though. As long as I don't die in the process. At least her death won't be a complete loss. 
Unless I can't jump this without her. In which case, fuck me. Oh no, I'm de mm. Mm. Doing great. We're just gonna do a full reset at the moment. Cause fuck it. Fuck it. <laughs> Back down to nine. I'm not trying to do this without losing any lives. Clearly, anyway. Come on, come on. God, he's bad at fighting. Oh no. Alright, so would you kindly hop, and then hop, and then jump, and there we go. And we still have to deal with these fucking things. Oh, but at least our kit reset, so we actually have some... Semi decent abilities for this section. Hurt. Okay. That was still dangerous and a little nerve wracking, but easier overall. Mini boss. What you got? Is it just a painting again? Might just be a painting again. Ooh. Cannot stand there. Good to know. It is just the same mini boss. Okay. <laughs> and we get a level. Or sorry, we get a life. Not a level. There, there are no levels in this game. So our huge mistakes just disappeared. I don't have enough bat points for this. Because I'm kind of curious what that ability might be, or that torch down there might be, but mm, not really worth it, I don't think. Oh, fuck. I didn't see the fairy. That fairy's a bitch. Alright, Alfred, it's all on you. Be the big hero you always wanted to be. Where'd that book go? Oh wow, what the fuck is that thing? Is that a Karen? Another fucking Karen? How do I get to it? Or rather, how do I, yeah, how do I get over here? There we go. That didn't fix the issue. That's super weird. That's the second time we've seen a barrier that I don't know how to get through. Huh. I'm like, I, I initially thought if I just killed the boss, then it would open up. Hmm. Let's go to our start menu. What is this? You find yourself regretting a grievous area of committed in the past, then this curse can undo the flow of time and give you the chance to begin anew. I don't want to do that. Wow, you can. Oh, it tells you if you miss something. R okay. That's really cool. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that though. That's an interesting, just whenever you fucking feel like it option though. They hid that. What if I had never hit pause? I never would have known. God damn, it's too tall. Hey, who needs that? Who needs that? Yeah, this section's gonna suck a little bit, I think. 
My money, no. Can I? <laughs> oh, Jesus. What the fuck was I supposed to grab that? Jeez. Some of these are really tough. Huh, I can never get to the end with the full team, can I? One of those things that's not supposed to happen, I guess. Damn it. I don't know what I was trying to do there exactly. This seems kind of like the final area, based on how high we're going. Oh, I can't jump on the staircase, right? Yeah, cheese him. Yeah, I'm such a hero. <laughs> or I guess this character might not be a hero. He's a vampire. He might be a bad guy. For all we know. I might even have to fight all my allies at the end of this. I don't know. I'm just assuming they won't stab me in the back the moment the quest is over. We're going to skip this. Oh no. I can only skip it so fast. Oh no. Oh no. Oh fuck! <laughs> I tried to skip too hard. Alright, Alfred. It's your time to shine. Now we have to learn the puzzle. I know how to skip this better in the future, at least. But now is not the time. Oh, Jesus, that does not kill him in one. That's good to know. Oh, it's this guy again. This guy's a jerk. Hurt? You know what? What do you got for me? Ah, rage. Wow! Is that double damage? Holy shit. That might be one of the best items in the game. You don't see it super often. I remember you guys. You guys are weird. And threatening. Oh. Well. Oh! That's interesting. I can use the ability and then switch to another character. Huh. But the timing on those fairies is nuts. I think it's worth it going to the left. Not really seeing the point. Just trying to fucking survive. I mean, we're gonna make it to the end, that's for sure. We're actually up a life now. 10 was our benchmark. Sure. Uh, Alfred's minorly injured. We're probably gonna do the entire fight with uh, the main dude. His name I'm not really sure of, to be honest. Fuck you guys, I'm out of here. Ah, <sighs> uh, we'll grab it. It is strong. And if it's, they're giving it to us, we probably need it for a reason. This is the end? No, this guy's weird looking. This is not the final boss, it's just a snake man. Oh, okay. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh! Oh, that's pretty fucking cool! Oh, damn. You can get a lot of hits in on this guy. Oh, 
Like a lot of, wow, yeah, he went down fast. Ooh, that still hit me, holy shit. I mean, I'm alive, but that still hit me. I hope those aren't instant kill on the hardest difficulty. Because that would be kind of brutal. To get through the entire fight and then die to that. But it seems like all, uh, all demons have, like, a inbuilt, like, suicide attack. They just, they all have it. Whether they realize it or not. Oh, what the fuck is that? <laughs> what? Oh. Alright, that's the bad times. Whatever that is. That did half my health. Something is mad. And I think it's mad at my existence. Holy, yep. Oh my god. I did not expect this. This is something new to me. Uh, you know what? What do you got? So I just gotta have to haul ass, I suppose. That didn't make any sense, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. You don't have to worry about this, so please don't. Just hold down the entire time. Oh. Something is made of bats, and that thing is very mad at me. Ooh. Right, they dash forward quite a, quite a distance, don't they? I'm gonna need to switch characters just to keep her alive. Killing its own people, too. That's neat. Hmm. If I go up and then back down. Yes, that's how you trick it. That's not how you trick it? Or is there just like a moment? Intriguing. This is just gonna start in a second anyway. Or is it a proximity to the left? Yeah, it's proximity. That's fine. Interesting. Interesting. Maybe there, there's. I mean, obviously there's some way to get around it, but. Oh fuck! It's a, it's a bunny, but now it's different looking. What am I doing? This is not how you fight bunnies. Oh, did he pop after one? Oh, her, her hop is short. Also, the main character... No, wait a minute, wait a minute. We did pick up a gauntlet at one point. Or, so I think we're just stronger than normal. Because that thing is dying in one hit when it definitely took two originally. Oh man, other people need health real bad. Hey, uh, fucking weird thing. I'm gonna get ya! Fucking fire, Karen. Yeah! <laughs> Jesus, that damage! No, she's not taking that. She needs health, and pretty much that's it. Would have been safer to be safe. <laughs> Would have been smarter to be safe. That's what I really mean. I'm gonna die in a pit. I need this one up, please. Oh no. I need the one up, please. Oh no! I need to jump at it. Good thing I gotta jump, girl. Cause girl, you gotta jump. 
because I'm going to die like a bitch here in a second. Oh, fuck that. If he was alive, I could have taken that path up there, but he is super dead. Poor Dracula. Sorry, poor not Dracula. Okay. Alright, you're you're big and scary. I just want you to know, sir. Oh my god. Oof. I should have swapped in the cast again. Okay, Alfred. You got this. Yeah, you actually do got this now. If you can get one shot. Yeah! Alfred's OP! Oh, they gave me two chances at that. Go, Alfred! You got this! You can beat any boss! You're the best, Alfred! You don't need anybody! You're gonna get fucked, Alfred! There's no right way around it! Oh, full health! Alright, alright, let's see what he can do. Oh god, he can be slow. I can't keep hitting those. I'm gonna die if I keep hitting those. I'm dead. <laughs> I got tricked by greed. Just by pure greed. Alright, what is this? Oh god. Oh wow, the water comes back. We're gonna reset. We're just gonna reset, it's fine. The one up comes back apparently, so we're not really losing anything. We're just gonna be neutral, it's fine. Actually. Now we're neutral. It's like this attempt never even happened. <laughs> I'm good at this game. <laughs> Can't you tell? All right, time for not stopping. I lied. Time for one stop. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, shit. I'm alive. I'm alive. Yes. We just skipped a bunch of horse shit. That's what we did. Also, she's almost dead, so we can't use her. Fuck. Oh, I can't believe what I've done. I cannot believe that was the full health that I just wasted. I can't keep doing that. Oh no. Oh, well. Mm -hmm. There she goes. If I had to lose anyone, it had to be her. Look, it's another full health. Ha ha ha. Uh, actually... Nope. We have three seconds of bat, that's not really gonna help us. We just have to move. You know what, I think the only person who could grab these and still survive would be the main character. Because he has a fast enough slash that it might work, if I'm jumping when I do it. Yeah, I'm gonna just walk away from you, if you don't mind, sir. Like, you're- oh, fuck. You're not fine. Oh, he's not that bad! I thought he would have a lot more health for some reason. Okay, now we don't care if he grabs the health, because he actually needs it. Just go, go, go! That was health! <laughs> that actually worked! Uh, I really should have taken Alfred out for that. Oh, there's, um... Hmm. Oh, hello. Boss fight? Why is it like this? Now it's a boss fight. 
<laughs> this might be the boss fight, too. Yep, that looks like a boss. Oh, no. Okay. Alfred, your assistance is greatly appreciated. Oh, that's new. How am I supposed to know? How am I supposed to know? Hey! That was a good combo. But that's only phase one, I bet. Now she's mad. Oh, I'm on an elevator. Am I gonna fight the moon? No. Oh no, I am going to fight the moon. Holy shit, this is awesome. I can break these. Alfred! I can't hit her. I can't fucking hit her. Uh oh. Those seem bad for me. Uh, oh, I can hit them after the fact. Oof. Sorry. I'm having a hard time watching what the fuck's going on. This is pretty nuts. Oh, those are fast, they're not the same. This is actually giving me a ton of points to use against her. That's good. Maybe she's also cursed by the moon. So I need to stay to the very edges on this one. And these create... Oh, I see. And that gives me the only ability I can use a fucking hitter. Christ. Ah, I need to actually see if there's points. If I can only hit it with that one fucking whip. So far, it seems to be the same pattern every time. Maybe a slight difference. Yeah, I'm hitting the moon. I'm not really hitting her, am I? Is he yeah, he's almost dead. Oh, they're not giving me juice anymore. Oh, no, they're sometimes giving me juice. Not as much as I want, but as much as I'm gonna get, I guess. Oh, there we go. Oh god, I only got one hit in that time. Uh, don't these follow my movements for a second? Yeah, they do. You know what? Come on, Alfred, you got this. Thanks, Game Sand Pizza. Yes, Game Sand Pizza. Oh, fuck! No! <laughs> I don't know how to hit her. <laughs> I was too busy making fun of the, your name that isn't actually your name. Alright, I guess Dracula will finish this fight. Oh, I have to do both parts again. Ah, shit. You don't know how to hit her is why you stopped playing the game for a while. Really? Oh. Oh no. Wait, that protects me from damage? Is this actually making me immune to I guess certain damage. That first phase pretty easy to spam through on this difficulty.
Honestly, it seems like using the main character's whip or Dracula's normal attack might be the best way to do it. Granted, we have 14 lives. That's a lot of tries on this boss. Okay, can't hit her from here. That was more than we started with. Okay. On the edge this time. I was slightly off on the edge. Oh, wasted my time. Oof, I'm taking bad damage from that. Bad bat damage. I should probably only attack her like that during the uh, the next phase. Oh shit, that's right. Oh, he's actually bad against this, isn't he? And so is he, because I can't really react. His his windup is real goddamn slow. Oh my god. Oh. Well. <laughs> Alright, uh, I'm just gonna... <laughs> yep. Uh, one health, uh... One health vampire, not gonna cut it. Not really good enough. Wait, I can do this infinitely, can't I? Because they're giving me a one-up every time I try. However, I'm now very curious. What's down here? What's what's across the road here? Oh. I'm assuming this is for him. It is. Okay. Gonna get back across. Probably. It does seem to be more point efficient to do his dash rather than just flying straight. Oh, but now I don't get his... Uh, I don't know if that was the right choice. We'll see. I think I made a mistake by grabbing that. Right there, lady. Just gotta spam her down. There we go. What skill I use? Stand in place, hit attack. Maybe I have to hit her handbag thing. I don't know what else to call it. She's like a little creature that's hanging off her hip. Does that have a hitbox? Doesn't seem to. All right, this is the first time she's actually been involved in this fight. And she's doing badly because of me. I'm 
I actually don't know how much damage that does. I think it's just a regular punch. A regular punch is worth. It's no, uh... Freeze gun. Freeze bolt. Freeze blade? Freeze blade. That's probably the right wording. Fortunately, that didn't really hit her that much. That's... That's fine. Oh, it's the big one. Ow. Don't want to go off the fucking edge. Oh, she's just gonna keep doing that now? Oh, no. Okay. That was a one-time thing. Thank God that was a one-time thing. Hmm. I shouldn't do that in the middle. Or from the side. It's actually not very efficient, is it? Oh, I'll get there eventually. And then she'll teleport around. Oh, maybe not. Good thing she's not just breaking the ground I'm standing on, you know? Cause that'd be pretty fucked. Hey! There we go. That wasn't awful. Oh no, we're all wounded. And she is just kind of exploding. Oh Jesus, he's holding it back! So he gets you was astonished by his own actions. For what reason did he do this? He existed to slay demons and take revenge. But long lost emotions had been rekindled. However, the time for that had passed, as his consciousness drowned in dark Oh god, that was too fast. Oh, bad end. I mean everyone else lived, so that's good, but And so, in order to stop the new Dark Emperor. Zengetsu's allies plunged into battle again. Oh, because I'm the new baddie. They may have to end their allies' life, but can they still save his soul? Probably not. He's the moon now. That's the real curse of the moon. You become the moon. To be continued. Now, I don't know if that to be continued means like, hey, play the game on a harder difficulty. Or if that means, hey, go play the sequel, go play Bloodstain, the Ritual of the Night, or whatever. I don't really know what that means, but this was a super good game that was literally just a stretch goal. That shows the talent of that fucking team so hard. If they just made this as a stretch goal, like, damn. This is a solid, solid game. Oh, what did you guys think? I thought it was damn good. We're probably gonna play again. I think we'll probably play this again on uh, Monday. And do like a harder difficulty or something. Because we don't actually have much on the docket. We're waiting for Bloodstain to come out. Uh, Ritual of the Night to come out. And that's on the 18th, so that's Tuesday. But we only do Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So we'll, we'll kind of like... We'll play it a day after pretty much everyone else has touched it, which isn't a bad thing. I generally don't like to play games on release anyway. Because then everyone's like, I can't watch, I gotta play it. I'm like, well, I guess I need to wait. <sighs> yeah, very solid. Good game. Great music, great mechanics. It was, it was just Castlevania. Just fucking Castlevania. Am I only getting started, Rick Chef? Okay. Is there a lot more to it? Yeah, this is the first time I've ever touched the game. Inti Creates. That is such a weird name. Thank you for playing. Nightmare Mode. 
Well, why don't we take a glance and see... Is that mirror mode just a higher difficulty? Oh, interesting. Is there a new game plus? Oh, no, that's not what I want. That's just fighting the last boss again. Alright, let's let's cancel out of this. So it says exit game, but I want to go to the title screen. It's, it's weird. I don't like that wording. In order to save Zengetsu, who has fallen into darkness, his allies set out. Uh, once more. Interesting. So it's not just the game at a higher difficulty. It's a different campaign entirely? That's pretty cool. That's actually pretty cool. Alright, well, I am unfortunately kind of tired tonight, so we're not going to be doing any more. But I'm happy we beat it once, and I guess on Monday, and potentially even Wednesday, we'll go through Nightmare Mode and the mode after that? Maybe? Whatever the fuck that is. But thanks for joining, everybody. Uh, we'll also be back on Monday for our daily Beat Saber. Yes, Game Sand Pizza. We did. I, I hit her with all my abilities, and she's dead now. But then I'm the demons. I was the demons all along. Or maybe not all along, but, you know. It is what it is. <laughs> we'll be back on Monday, though, to uh, redo all that. So thanks again, everybody, and see you next time.